I love hiking as well um, and should do it more or exercise more. But, you know, I realized that physical health is also very important and also things that like journaling as well, mm. uh, things like reading, podcasting, listening also in this era of social media as well to realize that how much am I consuming because that can play a role as well. So it's a very mm. holistic uh, approach um, in terms of how I'm cared for. It's not one dimensional in terms of pill popping. There's so much more that goes into it. And all those layers build up a good quality of life that I'm very proud of nowadays. Oh, I'm just you. listening to you and I'm thinking we could talk to you for hours and hours and hours on end. And uh, before we let you go, I wanted to ask you if there was one thing you could say to someone who's probably thinking, I don't know, should I get checked out? Should I not? You know, I'm not happy with my quality of life. I'm mm -hmm. not happy with my uh, performance at work. I'm not happy with the outcome of my relationships. Anyone that knows me knows <laughs> <laughs> there's a new Mr. Sumkin every so often. And now I had to get checked out for that. But, mm -hmm. you know, someone who's watching and thinking, could it be that I need to, to see someone? You know, what would you you say to them? I would say that if you find that you are not happy with your quality of life, in relationships, your work performance could be better, but there's something that's a stumbling block for you, how you're functioning holistically. I would encourage that you reach out to the right appropriate tool. Use the medical aids that are made available because they do provide things related to mental health nowadays. Mm. Use the support that's made available to you before it becomes worse because we don't want crisis intervention. Yes, it's very important to intervene in a crisis, mm. but a crisis is more expensive and, and expensive in all areas in terms of finances, emotionally, psychologically, and in, re in relationships. So it's very important to rather be proactive in terms of attending to preventive health care. So don't lose hope. It is not a death sentence to be diagnosed with a mental health condition if you are. It just means that your, your quality of life will improve based on the quality of the intervention. I'm a living testimony of that. And I must say you are a fabulous, beautiful, lovely, inspiring living testimony of just what can happen to your life when you get the right intervention at the right time.